Jillian, thank you. Now a check of the hyperlocal forecast. Gorgeous Friday. Yeah, spectacular, Tom and Brandon. But unfortunately, there will be some changes. So um, you might want to get out there and take advantage now before it does change. And as we take a local look out now at Westport, a nice clear evening and we've enjoyed sunshine all day long. It's nice and comfortable, a, a breeze and we've had uh, highs today that were slightly below average for this time of year. Looking now across our area, it is all clear, but as we look to the west, we're starting to see those clouds and they will be moving our way as we go into tomorrow. Also some rain that will be here as we go into the evening. So get ready for that. Saturday will be a little bit different than today and we start to see those clouds moving in tonight, maybe even a couple of sprinkles before sunrise and then throughout the day tomorrow, a couple of spotty light showers, but the heavier rain doesn't arrive until the evening. We could start to see that by nine o'clock at night. This is what what the radar could look like with some green on the map here indicating some light rain and then a quick round of some heavier rain shortly before midnight that will be moving off towards the east. Our skies clear humidity drops and Sunday is looking much better as far as how much rain we could see uh, maybe a half of an inch across our area and then uh, closer to three quarters of an inch possible north of the Merritt Parkway and that will be just enough to give us a good soaking in the ground before we get some more dry weather back on Sunday. We're down to 52 degrees tonight in Reading. It will be cool and if you'll be out early in the morning, you need a light jacket and throughout the day it will be cloudy and cool with a high of only 70 degrees in Rowayton. It does warm up a few degrees on Sunday with all of the sunshine. It will be beautiful by Monday. We have more of the same weather, but look at Tuesday. The rain is back and we'll see highs in the upper 60s and then it goes back to our beautiful weather for the mid middle to end of next week and look at how chilly it gets in the mornings. It will definitely feel like fall. There is more hyperlocal weather coming up in a few minutes.